sound does a wolf make when it's going to die? So the, there's so many great scenes in the film, but I wanted to ask about a couple towards the end. Um, don't worry, this won't go out until after the film's out, so no worries about spoilers. Um, so yeah, there's um, obviously Derek's death and then the memorial that follows is very emotional for longtime fans. And I wonder what was that both like for you both, you know, reading that in the script and then filming and being a part of that too? I mean, we're no strangers to loved ones dying on this show. Mm -hmm. But what I love about that, like even as hard breaking and as hard as it was to have Allison die, it is, mm -hmm. to me, necessary for our story to have these moments because I've experienced major death of a loved one. I'm sure so many of the fans have. And what we do the most best on our show is relating to people and having these catastrophic, life-altering losses. Mm -hmm. And so Derek, you know, fits right in that. And like he is by far one of the most loved characters. And and having to go through that mourning, the fans mourning with us and grieving and you know, doing it in a way where it's beautiful and we pay homage in such a beautiful, delicate way. I think that, I think, I think it's necessary for any storytelling to kind of, you know, if you're, if you're trying to be a relatable story, uh, to have that aspect in it. It was yeah. super moving. I, I cried every time I read that scene, um, the memorial, yeah. and then also being able to do it justice and be there and, and, and say my little speech, um, you know, it brought back a lot of uh, memories from my own past about that kind of thing. And yeah, it's, uh, it's cathartic, you know, it's not triggering. I, I, I'd rather accept it and cope and, 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 you know, live with it rather than try to shove it down. Um, yeah. So being able to do that for myself is, is super cathartic and therapeutic. And so I just, I think it was beautiful. Yeah, yeah I remember mm -hmm. filming the, the memorial scene and not, I feel like not, a lot of actors get the chance to have a monologue with the entire cast listening. Yeah. And I remember that day, and I remember all of us were just watching, I'm welling up, we're just watching Tyler, because we knew that also it's close to home, you know, and um, it, w it was just so poignant, that scene, and you were so present. It, it was so, 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 so beautiful, and we all felt it. It was, yeah. Truly, like it was, it was wonderful, and, and thanks to Jeff for writing in and for including it, not being afraid to really go in there and kill people, <laughs> right. but also for Tyler to like call upon that stuff to use it for art. It's really beautiful. Thanks. There is also, um, you know, it's just after in the film, your characters, you you have a happy ending of sorts finally, which is something you know, which fans probably didn't ever expect to see happen, given what you know happens obviously <laughs> in the past. Um, so, what was that like for you to again kind of read that and then? see and play that out. No. I felt giddy during that scene. Uh -huh. I felt really giddy and watching it back too, there's something about the way we, we our characters look at each other that feels um, still really youthful in a way, even though we're much older people, we're adults. And um, I think that essence of, of those, those two people in Team Wolf are, is still remains. And maybe that's mm -hmm. why people love them together. Yeah, absolutely. It's like, it's like young and youthful and innocent and genuine still. Yeah, that's what love is. Right. True love right. is youthful. And yes. It is always it's always is just it's 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 a beautiful balance of youthful energy inside of you while also, you know, mm. having this gnarly past mm -hmm. and kind of dealing with it and growing together and that's what I love about Allison and Scott, you know, they're, you know, number 1 always and uh, they're they're the essence of Teen Wolf, you know. And the fact that we got to come back and do it together again, I'm getting chills. It's, uh, it's, it was perfect. It was a perfect payoff. It was a perfect ending. And then seeing Allison's sort of um, uh, flashbacks was just like mm. so heart wrenching and beautiful. And then seeing where we were, I was 18 years old. And then now, you know, I'm 31, um, seeing them as like these like people with just this past and a future. It's really fucking awesome. Like, it's just, I'm so happy that we got to do that. Yeah. It's so too. cool. Thank you so, so much for chatting with me. Um, can't wait for everyone to see the film. And yeah, congratulations. Thanks, Dave. Thank you.